recently purchased some kitchen items from this store called The Home Quarter. A little thank you card and yeah. I've been seeing these so many places and I just wanted them to put in like my my tea and whatnot. I got three of these. I think they're cute and like really super aesthetic, you know, which is what we're going for. So I'm going to wash these and put, and put in, that smells like it was just manufactured. It smells like it was just manufactured. And they're only online, like you can find them online and then they work out of their home. So you can either go pick it up from them or yeah this is not sponsored or anything i just like the stuff that were on their page so i'm hooking you guys up as well because it's cute it's really cute i have a lot of um, similar stuff like this so if you wanted these and you're interested in these you can go get them i know they're also the at pep but these sizes were not and i wanted these sizes you know got three like i said cool so we've just had our breakfast and we are mustering collecting gathering the courage to go to the gym um hello hi i'm staying with maria yes goodness okay i was sitting down here guys and i'm not making this up i literally sat down switched on my camera to talk to you guys about seasons because i've been feeling compelled to talk about seasons having felt that i'm in a dry season for a long time and my dry season looked like you know i'm struggling with my research not really seeing where it's going research is tough applying to jobs getting negative feedbacks day in day out my battery's about to die but and then a few weeks ago this thing of seasons just kept coming up to me i kept seeing bible verses randomly about seasons and waiting and then i was like okay maybe this is a season you know and maybe i'm supposed to think about what I'm supposed to learn in this season rather than waiting for it to be over. So I started thinking, okay, patience, resilience, having that faith. And guys, oh, wow. I, I, wow. Um, my heart, my heart is going boom, 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 boom right now. Like I cannot, I cannot put it. I think I want to cry. I, you guys heard all of that. I am... This is crazy. It's insane. It's actually literally so, 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 so insane. I can't. I can't. I can't. <sighs> I don't even know who to call at this point. Ooh! We are going to call our mom. I know she's going to have so many questions, but I am literally, guys, you see my hand? I am shaking right now. <sighs> okay, my mom's phone is not ringing. I can't. Hello, mama. Hello, Hello how are you? I'm good, and you? I'm fine. How is the interview? I got the job. That's good. Yeah, that's well good. done. Thank oh, you. Nani Liu. Hi guys. <clears throat> so it's been an interesting 24 hours, but I'm here to update you. The last clip was me, obviously, on the phone getting um, a job offer. And yeah, basically, so much happened. To that 
till today just the next day from the last clip but i went to get my hair done i'm actually just getting back from getting my hair done and this is because my contract starts on the first of june today is the 30th of june so i just have tomorrow basically to like prepare and get ready to start going to work um and yeah so i thought it, the hair that i had in the beginning of this clip is not it wasn't neat anymore i wasn't comfortable with it i wasn't comfortable with that being my first impression um so we got our hair done we we're looking all cute now we're looking like corporate huns because that's what we are <laughs> yeah um it's gonna be a very big switch not just because it's a new job but also because it's an eight to five job guys yeah I, there's gonna be a lot of readjusting and adapting over the next couple of weeks i'm gonna try to take you guys with me everything through everything as much as humanly possible um but yeah we are happy we're feeling a bit overwhelmed a bit excited a lot excited a bit nervous but yeah i guess i mean if it's in my hands if it's here now i guess god god thinks i'm ready for it um so we, we're ready for it <laughs> we're gonna tackle it head on <laughs> obviously the trajectory of this video has taken a, a very sharp turn this was supposed to be a video about me talking to you guys about seasons and i was actually supposed to start this video last week um but then i had interviews and it was really really it was the interviews were like like that like i had one today reply tomorrow the next one the next day and then the weekend came and then monday came and the job offer came so like i couldn't start this video when i wanted to start it which is fine because I think the beauty of YouTube and the beauty of vlogging is that it's basically my visual diary. Like, I got the call. I can't make that up. You know, I can't re... I can't tell somebody to like, oh, can you call again so that I can record it on YouTube? I, that was just... It was very in the moment. It was exactly first... You guys got like a live reaction. A live, you know you saw it as it happened and that's the good thing that's the beauty of, of vlogging you know i'm gonna look back at this 20 years from now and be like oh this was my first job oh okay i've worked before but like yeah this is you know my first job in south africa this it's, it's a new experience you know i'm gonna look back at this one and i'm gonna be able to look back at it and be like oh look at this time this was a good time it was an overwhelming time but it was a good time and obviously i would have grown and come so far from now then and just being able to look at it i think is is beautiful but yeah it is currently 6 37 i just got back i got back to load shitting don't know what i'm gonna eat i did eat before i went but it's only six and i'm probably gonna get hungry I want to now, I have a video that I was supposed to up upload last week. I didn't upload it because I'm just feeling too lazy to add in music to that video. Um, but I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to have to do that right now. So yeah, I'm going to have to do that. And then of course I have some final corrections. No, I'm not, I'm, I'm, let me not lie. I'm not going to do that tonight. <laughs> yeah i'm just gonna try and add, add music okay i actually don't know when it stopped recording because my camera does that these days it just cuts me off but yeah i'm gonna try edit that video i have no plans of stopping youtube right now you know obviously this is something that i'm going to continue doing and i'm gonna continue like trying to fit it into my now new schedule but yeah i don't even know how to title this vlog guys because i don't understand what's happening anymore. <laughs> i don't understand what's happening anymore 
Hey guys, the lighting is so bad because I am in load shedding. I'm literally using a torch to do the stuff that I need to do because we start work tomorrow. Um, and I have load shedding today from 6 to 10.30. Like if that's not the devil trying to work, I don't know. I don't know. But I just did my brows. Ooh, I actually like how they came out. And I'm now just oiling my hair. I did my hair literally yesterday um, to get ready <clears throat> for like work. So, and then they like, I washed it at the salon for, the, for like the first time in a long time. And so they didn't like put oil on my hair. They used gel for braids. I did not lose braids, if y'all can't see that. Um, and so I'm just doing that right now. I was supposed to do that since morning so that this oil that I'm putting in doesn't just finish like doesn't just drip onto my pillow but yeah that didn't happen what the hell? but yeah so what I want to do now what did I want to do I forgot what I wanted to do cool. guys let me just tell you I am quite I'm looking at my mirror over here and I am watching what am I watching I'm watching a YouTube video I'm watching this youtuber called Sitati Letsipa. Sitati. Sitati Letsipa. I don't know. I recently discovered her channel and actually enjoy her vlogs. Like, I feel like she's a very... Why is my torch on? Oh, it's actually giving me more light. Oh, okay. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. So, we're watching YouTube videos while we do this. I also want to put, like, um, gel on my hair which is actually why i started this vlog because i'm doing the most you know me you know that i do not gel my edges i just don't have the time for that i don't have the energy for that ever ever but um i wanna i wanna just just do something to them show them a little bit of love i also want to figure out how i'm tying my hair tomorrow i don't know if i want it like down like this I think we're gonna do like a high pony just to have my hair out of my face you know what i'm overthinking it <laughs> i'm literally overthinking things but hey i have not been like to an office in such a long time so you can imagine you can understand i have um i do know in my head <laughs> What I want to wear tomorrow, you know, first day fit and whatnot and whatnot. So that's not going to be a problem. I just know that I want to do all that I need to do. I have a video that's busy uploading and then we are going to bed. Like we are going straight to bed. We need to wake up fresh, no underbags. Guys, my, my timetable is about to change so much and i'm taking you guys along with me for the journey it's gonna be beautiful it's gonna be amazing what am i doing now we're doing gel where is my gel even voila. is it voila? <laughs> is it voila again like what do you say it's <laughs> it doesn't matter it's a saturday guys i'm going to the red bull event i was invited to an event by red bull i think a month ago and then Hey guys, okay, so we are ready almost. I just need to pack up my bag now. I wanted to leave by 7:30. It's 7:33. Yeah, we don't want to be late on our first day. There are gonna be plenty of days for us to be late, you yeah? know. Especially book. i 
unspoken sounds. Yeah, you don't hear what I speak. Listen down to my feet, taking words. Don't I like it so easy? Don't tell me it's so hard. Don't tell me all your secrets, but don't just be showing off. I'm gonna tell the truth. It ain't that bad or good. Two girls and no boys too. I'll be the last to start and the first to leave. Oh, I'ma play the part convincingly. I got a lot on my mind and all my shit. I'm way behind. But if you check my pages, I'm doing fine. You'd think being smart was my hobby, acting dumb was my job, being lazy is comfy, doing work is too much, acting crazy is easy, and coming down ain't no fun. Saturday today, um, I did start work on Thursday so I had Thursday and Friday of work and now it is the weekend <sighs> a lot is going on I also needed to go to clicks let me give you a little haul let me give you a haul because it wouldn't be my channel if I didn't show you what I got so from clicks we got soap from Vaseline and this is for me to take to work is that focus? But you know what Vaseline is. I got this CeraVe, 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 um, under eye cream. Eye repair cream, they say. I've been wanting an eye cream because I don't have one. Um, and I feel like I have dark circles. I don't know. I feel like I do. Maybe it's just my bags. But I'm going to try out this. And if they don't, if it doesn't give me any issues, We'll start using this. I don't even know how much it was, and I don't want to think about that. Oh, here's the receipt, even. How much was it? Oh, that's why my bill was high. That's why. It's the eye cream. Um, and then I got this Eucerine lip balm, which I actually want to test out right now i want like a lip balm that's gonna be good for winter the size of this and its price two different things completely different but i think it's gonna be good for work tastes weird but it feels really good so I like it I think I can yeah I like it I also got this Eucerine hand cream this is also for work so these two are going to be no wait what these three are going into my work bag and yeah that's their sole purpose work let's try you out i haven't washed my hands since i got back but i just really want to try this out and this okay maybe i should put it on after i wash my hands i'm not sure if it's the cream that smells like this or if it's the combination of everything on my hands oh i also did my nails today um this color wasn't my first option wasn't my first option but they didn't have all the colors that i wanted so i settled i mean i like it but i don't love it you know anyway and lastly we got an eyeliner yeah the eyeliner and i got some flowers i cannot wait i got tulips i've been wanting tulips and i've said that the first flowers that are gonna go in my vase that i bought like i don't know three videos ago are going to be tulips but i haven't really got around to buying them because tulips are so expensive you know they're very expensive but today i said i'm gonna do it because if i don't do it now i'm never gonna do it and i need to put the tulips in so i can start putting the cheaper ones like carnations 
we have to go out today later where's my phone we are supposed to go out with a friend for yeah um i'm supposed to go out for dinner i was supposed to be brunch and then we canceled brunch and made a dinner but now everything is booked everywhere we wanted to go is fully fully booked so i don't know what we're gonna do about that yeah anyway let's do a little flower arrangement and then we will deal with the other stuff when the time comes if the truth be told and we were being totally honest most of us don't like waiting particularly if we're waiting for something to change or something to get better waiting can be a very frustrating experience but the worst kind of waiting of all is waiting on God when God forces you to wait for things to get better in your life for things to improve to change to reverse and nothing is happening and yet over and over and over and over and over again in the Bible we're told to wait on the Lord 